hurt yourself. That would be terrible. Even worse, you could fall overboard. And remember, it's only these ladies up in the front row who have been written off by the insurance company as expendable. If they go in the water, they're eaten by the alligators, no problem. But we don't want to lose anybody else. That would look bad. So if you have to stand up for a moment to get a better view, that's fine. Just be very careful and, of course, try not to block anybody else's view. What a beautiful day for a boat ride, huh? Anybody on the boat not from Florida? Anybody not from Florida? Oh, what a surprise. You folks not from Florida, actually, the weather's like this every single day here. It's like this beautiful. Pretty nice, huh? I was just about to enter the upper lake of the Mayaka River. This lake is thousands of years old, and sometimes it gets really shallow. Just a few months ago, the lake was only three feet deep. Right now, it's about seven feet deep. And the reason for the difference in depth is the lake is filled entirely by rainwater runoff from 550 square miles around. And um, we've had very erratic rain this past year, so the lake's only seven feet deep. The lake's about 1,000 acres in size, and it's about a mile wide. The widest point's directly in front of us right now. The lake's about two and a half miles long and it's fed by the Mayaka River. The river enters the lake about two miles to our 